So uh, first of all, let, let me to introduce you some um, cases from my clients. So um, yeah, I'm very happy to share you about my cases. Uh, what about cases? Yeah. So uh, last week, uh, sorry, it's last month. Uh, some of my uh, one of my clients asked uh, me for the battery for the uh, mm -hmm. ball machine. You know, was ball machine? Oh, yeah, something I like a uh, yeah, mm -hmm. something like a tennis ball machine, mm -hmm. and, mm. and maybe the uh, <coughs> baseball machine. It's yeah. something like a machine that is for training, for entertainment, that uh, mm -hmm. for personal friends. Something like for baseball. Okay. okay. So you okay. can stand here mm -hmm. and. The, the ball machine is is extend, extend you. Uh, yeah, and yeah, yeah, yeah. This, yeah. And, and so you can stay here, and the ball machine will so uh will will shoot you. Shoot, yeah, yeah, shoot me uh, and with some spec uh, for, with some sand frequency. Mm -hmm. so, and yeah, so you can hit the ball, hit the ball, and make the make the training, make the training, and make yeah. fun with that. So uh, first of all, so. Okay, take my notebook and um, mm -hmm. okay. And so, do you know something about the ball machine? So the ball machine is, is uh, for entertainment and the training is uh, something like a training tools. You can say that and it's fit for maybe for school, for your home use, for something mm -hmm. special, uh, training, uh, yeah, professional training. For yeah. for a training hall maybe, and so it is generally speaking for a professional training. So uh, how is the board machine working? So uh, we can so we have video. a video to okay. form uh, something for, for a, a famous brand of a tennis ball machine. So uh, how does a tennis ball launcher fire balls as oh. fast as a pro? Can you hear the voice? Okay. The oh. sequence sits at the heart of the machine. Oh. Two electric motors drive the launch wheels in opposite directions. High speed bearings help them spin faster than the rotor on a helicopter. A banana shaped ramp feeds in the balls. They squash down to half their normal size. Shoot out faster than a freight train. Hey, this is the same thing. But spinning wheels at such speed, this is the same thing. All wheels have tiny weight imbalances that make them shake noisily from side to side when they spin quickly. It's one racket you don't want on a tennis court. What I have to order right here is just measuring the wheel. The wheel is really, really balanced right now. Jose makes sure all the wheels run smoothly. His machine measures how much the wheel wobbles and where the excess weight is. His aim is to get this gauge to read less than one. To remove the weight, Jose simply drills holes in the wheel's rim. Your machine is done, you put the wheel, mm -hmm. you have the wheel between six, six and seven on your right hand side. This is the process that we have to do over and over again. Maybe four more. This is what we want. And it should be ready to go into a machine. Once balanced, each wheel runs perfectly smoothly, <laughs> making it quieter and more accurate. But tennis isn't all about how fast you can hit the ball. This machine also has to fire the ball into different parts of the court with pinpoint accuracy and mix up the shot styles. The launch wheels can swing in any direction like a gun turret to guide them two motors connect to two precision gearboxes these reposition the launch wheel 
points in a single second. To hit balls into every corner of the court with deadly accuracy. The launcher rarely gets a single ball out of court. But making this machine so accurate takes time and skill. Workers assemble and test every aiming mechanism by hand. They even have a special name for it. This part of the machine is called a guts. Douglas has assembled tennis ball launchers for 15 years. But guts are no good without a brain. So Douglas must calibrate the computer that controls where the ball goes and how fast it fires to train this machine to play like a real pro. That's a motherboard, the one that runs the whole thing. It simulates a player. This is where the fun begins. <laughs> Douglas lines up the machine with markings on the factory floor. It should hit the black line in the center of the back of the net. I would have to shift the pot to the left. I think you should do it or it should be centered. Let's give it a go. There you go. That's right. This machine will now fire balls anywhere in the court with pinpoint accuracy. It can play with top spin, back spin, and even hits a pretty mean lob. The tennis ball launcher is an unsung marvel of modern ingenuity. The perfect partner. It's there when you need it. It doesn't tire. And it never criticizes your serve. How does a tennis ball launcher fire balls as fast? Okay, so, so uh, um, Diego, uh, okay. could you please introduce your client about uh, this lithium battery? Uh, yeah, so uh, so first of all, let's mm -hmm. focus on the, uh, the, the video before. So uh, actually, you see before that, uh, the video is show um, yeah, how, the, how the ball machine working. So it mm -hmm. is, uh, it, 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 it's most important is that it needs two motors uh, to drive and, mm -hmm. and power. The, the machines to, so you can get a ball from the machine so yeah. which are very fast yeah. and very um very fast speed uh, with uh, some stand frequency yeah and you can something you can as a jack it something like uh just uh, the, the, the speak and the uh, um frequency so you can get different <clears throat> different balls from that okay so um yeah, so uh, for the uh, classification, so um, for the ball machines, uh, you know that in the market, something like uh, this is the ten, uh, ten ball, ten, tennis ball machine. So you have uh, another something like um, table tennis machines, um, badminton machines, and baseball uh, ball machine, and uh, a basketball machine. So um, for this, this, this different machine is the same, uh, same protocol free, except um, they also use the motors to drive, uh, to lead the machine to give some uh, power to the machine. So to, um, to give up the very good training. So uh, you know that for the, the motors, uh, we need the power to 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 lacking working. So um, so now we will need the battery, right? Maybe something. Yeah. Like, yeah. Uh, so uh, I have uh, some. I have to some searching on the uh, we, uh, on the website that for the board machine something we have two ways. The what? The first way is using the AC, you know. T two uh, ways? Yeah. Two, okay. two ways to, to power. To power? Yeah, to power the machine or to let the machine work is for the AC and the DC. Mm -hmm. You know, for AC, we need uh, natural grid. Yeah. So for this machine, especially for the 
yeah, inner door using you can have you can see that in the training hall you can see in your home or some uh, school maybe and for the dc um yeah for the dc mode uh for the for the dc model so um something like you should need a battery you know if you know have a battery it can work so for this machine maybe some uh some is for the outdoor fusing something like you have a training in the outdoors in uh, outdoors in under the air under the sun so um you will have the uh yeah have a dc uh for machine so maybe some of them you have a two ways both for the ac from dc so you can use it in the indoor and or in, in the outdoor. okay so uh <coughs> For the DC machine, so uh, you know we will use the battery. You know, we, we, we will not need a battery in the before. We will use the lead acid battery because this have uh, so much long, uh, so much long time experience in the uh, in the index industry for the lead acid machine uh, for the lead acid battery. But uh, you know the that battery. Yeah. So, but uh, you know that uh, the acid battery is not an eco-friendly battery. So I will, we will talk something about it to you before, uh, after. So uh, now we will use the lead acid battery. Uh, so we now we will use the lithium battery to uh, replace the lead acid battery with a very high uh, energy bandings with uh, uh, eco-friendly yeah, functions. Yeah. So what is the difference about the lead eight battery with the lithium battery? How about the have a six? Yeah. yeah, so uh, let's yeah, focus my step, okay? Yes. So, uh, okay. <clears throat> so uh, first of all, ask your question me that uh, about the cases for my client. Okay. Yeah, it, this is a, some is a client from EU, so we could call him Jake, right? Uh, so Jake, uh, Jake, uh, sent me an inquiry in uh, last last month and asked me about that. Hey Diego, so um, he had some um, inquiries for the lithium battery, uh, for the bore machine. So uh, I know that, ah, okay. So uh, to power the bore machine, you know that uh, it is using the motor. So I uh, asking about that, hey, how works the rate power of your motor? So uh, Jake uh, maybe uh, sent me some data sheets and he, he gave me some uh, information. And but uh, the information I think it's not uh, too much enough for the for the lithium battery because uh, to know the to know how to know the battery if uh, to know if the lithium battery can work with the machine we, so we can know that that uh, the most important key is the discharge currents. So as you know that uh, the discharge currents will power the motor. So if the the current is slow, it's more, it's not enough to power, so power the motor, so are the machine not working. So, so um, I search some details and so I make these um, lections uh, to introduce the board machine. So uh, first of all, uh, after searching, I know that in the market, uh, most of the brewer machine uh, is from the, uh, I mean the rate power is from uh, 17 volts to maybe uh, more than up, up to 300 volt. Yeah, so uh, based on this uh, rate power, so uh, normally the, the, the brewer machine is under a cap voltage System. So you know that uh, we will use the lithium battery or the acid battery uh, with the 12 volt voltage. And for the capacity, so if the capacity is higher, so you can have a long 
have a longer using time, uh, have a, a long working time. So if the capacity is more, so you have a short working time. That's the difference. So uh, I, I tell Drake, hey Drake, um, uh, I know that in the market, mm -hmm. uh, uh, the, the rate power of the four machine is from uh, 17, power, uh, 17 volts to up to uh, 300, 300 volts, uh, watts. So um, if you can have a, a very uh, exciting uh, details and of the raw machine, so I think uh, it's better for us to uh, to maybe recommend recommend to our lithium battery. So uh, very lucky that uh, Jay can offer me some of the details, and uh, finally I, I okay I I recommend him. Uh, 12 volt 24 amps per hour lithium battery for choices because you know that for with this battery uh, you can have a very um, maybe more than I think it's more than uh, more than one hour of working time for maybe one to two hours time for the machine to working uh, to work and um, uh, with this battery uh, the, our our discharge coverage is up to uh, 20 amps. So with be such a higher uh, current uh, discharge current, so we can power our board machine with that. So this is our uh, solution for my client Jake from EU. So uh, yeah, this is my sharing. And you know that, so you know that if we talk about the bore machines, so first of all, we can know, we should know the uh, rate power of our bore machine. Or if you know the discharge currents, that is very bad for us to uh, recommend you to uh, the lithium battery because the, the discharge current is the most important key for um, for these cases that you can tell me the rate power, so I will calculate with the uh, with the rate power uh, between uh, the rate power with our voltage, right? So uh, to to calculate the current, so or you can directly tell us the current. So um, we will have a very best uh, solution to you. So if uh, our clients of uh, some of or that you are working with a poor machine or if you want to buy a poor machine or something you have you are doing the business with the poor machine, it's good. You can feel free to let me know and I will recommend you the lithium battery to yeah to power your poor machine. Yeah, this is this is for DC using, right? So if you use an AC machine. Uh, with uh, if you use in indoor with a national grid, there is no need for for a lithium machine. That's it. Yes, yes, of course. But uh, also maybe you will have a, a lithium battery to have a, as a backup a, as a backup power. So if you if the if the national grid is power off, yeah. So you can have a backup battery to power your bore machine to keep the training. Yeah, to go ahead the training, I think. So, yeah. So yeah, I think it's necessary to, uh, as, a lead, as a backup power, I think, whatever you use the DC or AC machine. So, but on, uh, I think in the market, in the recent market, in, this, in these years, um, the machine maybe have two models, yeah, for AC, both AC and DC. So if the grid is off, uh, you can use the DC with the battery, yeah. So um, this is my sharing of my cases for my my client Jay. Great. Yeah, yeah for the poor machine. So mm -hmm. let's take a, a look on our our yeah our. Screen, yeah, we have. I also have a sorry, 
one video about the no video is yeah my 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 file yeah yeah the the file yeah okay right. yeah so uh in this file and um, i will introduce you some something about the tennis floor uh something about the board machine so uh first of all i have three questions to some of you if you uh something yeah somebody if uh using or maybe uh something uh, somebody which uh don't use the board machine okay so thank floor, you so much uh, do you ever come across below troubles first yeah no, no coach so the improvement of the board skills slow right so no choice so no one to teach you so the, the improvement is slow is too much slow uh, the, the, yeah 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 the second one is no partner so you you know the no partner is mm -hmm. so so no one to um maybe to send you the balls yeah and you can get that and you have no training okay so you know that to do the sports like tennis ball we use two men right two people so if you know no partners with you so you may can't hit the ball you can now do the sports you can have the great training okay that's the final one the third one is the training free is too much high so if you take part in the training maybe association you have uh, too much high as training free to the coach to the teacher to some of the, the guys that who trade you or who teach you the ski so um do you ever have the free um question or, or have a free troubles uh for for the while you have the training yeah if so so you, you need a board machine so um so this is our this is the picture which i showed in the, on, on the internet is a hand board machine in something like this you have a handler um if you have a portable handler uh something like um your your case yeah yeah it's still case right so uh here you can see this is a, a holder maybe for for holding so much more tennis for here so here is the shooting hole yeah this is the wells that uh, you can travel you can move your board machine from A to B, from B to C, uh, yeah, from outdoor to indoor, indoor to outdoor, yeah. So this is the look, uh, the looking of our board machine. So here you will see there is different way, uh, training way with, our, uh, the, uh, with the board machine. So straight from uh, left, uh, from the right, Yeah, something like that with two ways, one, yeah, to the left, to the right, right, to the short way, short left, short right, yeah. Oh, it's like top training. Yeah, it's like, yeah, it's training with a board machine. Yeah, mm -hmm. this is the wave, this is the shooting way maybe from, from the, the, the board yeah. machine. It can so many ways to shoot, shoot the ball. Yeah, yeah, yeah too much way. And yeah, you can see here it is a radon uh, okay. training schedule. Yeah. yeah, so you can see the board from a different way, different position, uh, different direction to the different position uh, yeah. of the curve. Yeah, yeah. And also, you can see that this is the vertical uh, weight. You can shoot too much higher, more higher, and lower. Yeah from different ways and different height, uh, different heights, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So for the tenable machine, as I said before, there is normally uh, from um, maybe uh, 11 volts uh, to up to maybe 200 for the tenable machine. So you can see here the rate power of this the machine is 150 mm -hmm. volts. 
so you can know that the pit so uh, yeah and here you can say this is the powering way powering way have two ways the first one is the ac power ac power you can see here this is for uh, 110 volts is for maybe north america yeah for the Japan, so maybe for the South Africa using with this uh, national grid. And uh, here is the 220 volts. Yeah, this is for maybe for the EU. I think EU is 230 or 220. And maybe for, for action, yeah, for the Africa using. And this is the AC power. And here you can see the DC power is for 12 volts. So that's why I recommend my J using a, a lithium battery at 12 volt and 24 amps per hour. Yeah, this because the, um, the, the, the machine is using the DC power with uh, DC voltage with uh, 12 volt. So uh, this some um, information for the table board machine. So it is not very important for that far. I think it's most important for us is the ray power. So if you know the ray power, you know the the voltage the 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 board machine using. So you can get the discharge ray. Okay. So yeah, you so know if. Uh, if the clients know the ray power, then you can recommend uh, about the lithium battery. How how many capacity? Yeah, the capacity means uh, it means that how how long you can use the bore machine, right? So uh, uh, we will have a calculation based okay. on the ray power, I think, and. Okay. I will have an example to you after the selection, okay? okay. So I will, I will let you know uh, how, how, how we calculate it and have a basic uh, recommend. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Of course, the, uh, this is the basic one. So if you have a very big budget, uh, we can also uh, recommend you a very high capa capacity of the lithium battery. Because you know, the, you know that if you have a large battery, budget, okay. yeah, so the battery it can be very bigger, so you can have, have a very longer training time, so the bore machine can work very for so much long time. I think so. Yeah. Um, so the important way, uh, the most important key is the right power and the and the the power, the using power, how to say? It means that um, the, uh, the, the bore machine is you can, can the power up, can the bore machine use DC power? So if it can use DC power, only AC power, uh, maybe you, maybe not necessary for lithium battery, or maybe you can buy a one to as a to be a, a backup power thing. Yeah, this is the, the tenable board machine. So here you can see that's the banter machine. Yeah, the banter machine yeah, is something like the same as the board, the table board machine, but you know that the badminton, the badminton is with a too much higher weight, so uh, the high will be higher. So you can see it's too much higher. And this one is like uh, a baby, right? It's very like a baby. And this one like uh, maybe a, a, a human, no? Uh, an app, app downs, right? Mm -hmm. So here, so you can see here we will have a board holder. So if we have too much board here, so this is the shooting, uh, shooting hole here. This is the body, and this is for the raising and down. Yeah, this is the controller here with the switch to power on and power off. And here is the battery. You can see it means that 
um, this machine can accept the AC power and DC power here. Yeah, this is the uh, stand. This is the supporter, right? To support it to stand on the ground, I think. So this is the outlooking, something like uh, the telephone for more machine. Um, so as I said before that the most important key is about the rate power. So you can see here the rate power is 120 and, and, and volt, uh, volts yeah, oh, here. So uh, yeah, the rate power here. So I um, think this one is also used a tap voltage uh, tap voltage system. So uh, also for these cases, if some client want to know the pattern for the machine, so I will recommend him also a uh, tap volts lithium battery with such a, a power uh, rate power here. So you can see here the rate power is not much too much higher. It's just for 112, uh, 120 volts. So what's next? So wow, you can see here this is a basketball basketball sorry <coughs> basketball machine. So for basketball more machine, there's a, a bigger system I will introduce you after. So you can have a looking on how it consists. You can have a very big basketball basketball net right here, a basket a net to uh to correct the basketball while you are shooting on the basketball ball and the board falling down and the board will will uh will uh I think it will correct here and so here is the shooting hole so you can get the board from here. <clears throat> So this is the looking for a basketball machine. So uh, you can say here there is have a yeah have a word say uh, it is uh, if for the if for the for the optional lithium battery choices and is it recommend the tel the twenty four volts uh, fifty amps per hour lithium battery with a using time from five and six to six hours. So you can say you can see here with a, a higher voltage for 24 voltage. Yeah, 24 volts. That's because the bus basketball machine with a higher rate power. Yeah. So as we always talked before that the rate power is the most important uh, data for the for the board machine. So if you know the the rate power and know the maybe the voltage we will get the current. So we we'll know how many we use how many current to power our board machine. No. So uh yeah you can say here it accept the AC power for okay also for one hundred and ten volts and 220 volt for different markets for this one is for the north america and this one is for uh yeah for 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 africa for asian and maybe for europe right and so here is for dc power is 24 voltage is a higher voltage as we've said before that's why because you can say here this the rate power show is up to uh up to three, 300, right? So you can say here is 280 volt, volts, yeah, the rate power. So with such a higher rate power, uh, we, have, we have a higher, a higher voltage, right? So uh, this is the basketball, basketball ball machine. So uh, yeah, let's end here because there's no no any words in the in the lecture. So we will have a, a simple summary that uh, if you have uh, any requirement on the lithium battery for the 
four machines. So first of all, uh, we should note the red power of the blower machine. Yeah. Uh, also, uh, it's better uh, if you have the discharge current, it's better to let, me, let us know. But uh, if you only have the red power, it's OK. And another one is if you have the uh, data of the uh, DC voltage, yeah, it's, it's, it's very frank, frank for you to uh, let, let us know. So we will have a better calculation uh, how much discharge uh, current for the for powering the bore machine, right? So uh, this is about the bore machine. You can say here, tennis bore, tennis bore uh, the, the, okay, the badminton, the basketball machine. So maybe I, there is, there is need a, 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 a introduction for the base the base floor, maybe for the table te uh, table tennis floor, but uh, for next time I will make it four because um, the short time for me to prepare it, and I should know more about about the uh, base floor. I think maybe in 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 North American most uh, and in Japan Japan Japanese uh, maybe many many people like the baseball for the baseball association for the baseball uh, training right so um uh, i think baseball is baseball machine is very um, popular and maybe some of the, the, the guys will buy yeah for the training at home yeah maybe or at the outdoor so okay this the, this is the baseball machine so uh let me introduce you how we can, uh, yeah, how we can calculate the, the discharge current. So, okay, I will say here, if you know the rate power, right? Rate, sorry, rate, uh -huh. okay, rate power for the bore machine, for the bore machine, right? Bore machine is is starting from 100 or, or maybe for steamer to up to 300 volts, right? This is the data from from the market. So if you know the rate power, so uh, for the tennis ball, uh, badminton, badminton, okay, and table tennis ball, table tennis ball, table tennis ball, and maybe baseball, right? Baseball. So for this ball machine, machine, yeah. The voltage is 12. So remember that the voltage is 12 volts. So you can get the current. Current, right? Current, yeah. current. Yeah. It's ray power. And it's, how to say it? I don't know. Voltage. Something like the example. Example. Sorry. Example. If you get a bore machine, something like a, a cannibal bore machine is with 115 volts, so you can get the current is about, I think it's about 11 or 12 amps. Mm -hmm. yep. Let me calculate for you, okay? Yeah, so you see here? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's, yeah. It's the 12.5. Yes, sure. Okay, I have a... Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, sure. Oh, sorry. Okay, okay. Yeah, so, okay. You can get the current, discharge current, 
like this. Yeah. So with the current he uh twelve point five m. How many? How, yeah, you can power. You can use for this current. Sorry. How many hours we can use? Yeah, that's based on the capacity, right? Uh, so yeah. yeah, if that we will recommend you. The lithium battery, 12 volt, and maybe higher than, yeah. So with this power, you can Alex can using one hour, yeah, because you can get, yep, you can get this um, power, and the current maybe for this one, the uh, the discharge current maybe up to, uh, sorry, it's up to 12 amps. Yeah, so it means that this this lithium battery. A set have a uh, maybe have a ability of this charging with uh, up to fifteen amps per uh, at, at fifty pounds at fifty amps uh, this charging current. So if the, this current is higher than this one, so it means that you can power in your motor, right? So if you wanna. Yeah, if you want a long using time, so uh, we, mm -hmm. this is for our uh, recommend, right? So you have a, uh, uh, if you have a higher, higher version, so you can have a 12 volt and up to 18, yeah. So uh, 13 amps per hour, so you can have a maybe this one for one hour's using, and you can get a two hours using with such a higher version, right? Use a very higher capacity, right? Yeah. So, so this is how we calculate it uh, with the rate power, the voltage to get the current, and using the current to know how big the how big the lithium battery uh, you can use. And based on this, this is a requirement one or a basic one for using for one hour using. So if you have a higher budget, or uh, yeah, we can have for two hours, three hours, and four hours more bigger, right? For the lithium battery. So this yeah. this part is for the capacity, a very high capacity using. So um, yeah. This is how we are calculate, and this is the calculation of the rate uh, with the rate power and the voltage and the power resistance. Right. So uh, let me have a final summary, and then uh, let uh, our engineer, Mr. Zhao, to introduce you and other things. So uh, let me have a, a summary. So uh, if our client, if some of you are working, yeah, yeah, working. Okay. Yeah, if some of you you are doing the business with a bore machine, right? Or some of you uh, have a, are doing business with the bore machine and or the lithium battery. So you can you can uh, you can ask me for uh, a solution. The lithium so in these lessons, we not just uh, we are not the bore machine manufacturer. Uh, we just. Uh, this year, uh, yeah. by the way. Yeah, no, no, no. This is just our application for us. And you know, we are a lithium battery. So uh, we have a different, different, different way, a different application for that. Um, so if you are the, you are, if the application of you is the board machine, like handball board machine, uh, man, uh, badminton, and table tennis, uh, basketball, or even the baseball machine. Uh, so you will uh, feel free to let me know, uh, and I will recommend you the lithium battery to power your board machine. Yeah. Uh, yes, you can have a. You can take the uh, lithium battery as a backup power if your machine is only using in the uh, in the in indoor. Uh, indoor, right? So if you mm -hmm. once you using it in, uh, outdoor, you know that uh, you should need a power to power your board machine. So um, the lithium battery is your best choice because you know uh, 
the lithium battery is the past is the uh, yeah is is with a, a very cheap uh, a very lower using right so for the lithium battery and you it will have a longer maybe longer uh, using time long longer working time and uh, the weight is high too much uh, the weight is too much uh, lighter than the lead acid battery so you can take your bore machine outdoor uh, and take your lithium battery outdoor so much easy right so um okay oh sorry so uh let our uh, let's pass. Yeah, let's pass. So, uh, so this is yeah. Hi, this is Diego. So this hi, is this is Willen. Yeah. So this that is my uh, introduction for the bore machine with a lithium battery. Thank you battery. so much for yeah. the lithium Diego. battery. So okay. uh, if you need a bore machine, uh, sorry, if you need a lithium battery for the bore machine, please le let me know uh, and some tell me your cases, your your application, and I will give you a solution with a lithium battery. For power your machine, right? So um, thank you, thank you for for listening. So let's. Give